The Rio Bravo Nature Reserve has been considered natural heritage of humanity. Near this natural beauty is the municipality of Galima el Darien and the Lake Galima. This attraction is particular in creating an intimate relationship with nature as a result of its wonderful landscapes and waterfalls in the middle of the forest. Although it has not been possible to set up a defined inventory, it is estimated that there are 313 species of birds. As you can see, we're currently bird watching, birding, hardcore birding to enjoy ourselves, to have fun, and also to make the lists. We need to make inventories of the different species we found at different sites. So this is why we are here, we are a professional guide, we have Sarah also here, my biologist, we have Maria here, my multimedia specialist, we have Ivan here, who is the, the owner of the hotel we are staying at, and together we will develop birding tourism here in the area. This is also one of the strategies of Belacanos, of the, my travel agency, to go into the regions to work together with the local people and to develop touristic offers to develop quality tourism in Colombia and to include everybody in the area to have a sustainable development. What do you see, Sarah? I saw an eagle. Uh, it has the, the tail like a seagull. Um, it's flying very high together with a vulture. Swallow tail kite. Now we arrive to Yotoko Forest, a national forest reserve which is patrimony of the National University of Colombia near Cali in Valle del Cauca. It has an extension of 559 hectares and is between 1,200 and 1,600 meters above sea level. This natural reserve has an adequate ecosystem which houses many species. It serves as a natural laboratory in which investigations can be made in the identification and characterization of the natural ecosystem. Due to its diversity in species, it is a very good place for birdwatching activities and also exotic animals can be seen, such as the howler monkey. We are here in the department via the Cauca, actually on a road trip and investigating different areas in Colombia for creating new brand for birding. Colombia is the second most richest country in terms of biodiversity after Brazil. In terms of birds, Colombia is number one. Of the over 9,000 different species of birds worldwide, you find almost 2,000 different species in Colombia. So that's why my team and I are traveling around all Colombia. When in 2002, everything started to change in Colombia, the country became safe and accessible for foreign travelers. Everything started with backpackers. This is also what you see today. There are still many backpackers all around Colombia and many hostels where you can have a very decent and cheap stay. But Colombia has much more to offer. Quality tourism is growing. There are many, many wonderful places. Potentially huge. You can horse ride, you can do safari, you can uh, have beach holidays, you can dive, you can whale watch, you can go and see how coffee is produced. Colombia is one of the biggest coffee producers in the world. There's so much to discover. So, I invite you, come with us, join us on our journey around Colombia. <laughs>